Now we are going to the reception results from this radio. They are not dramatic, but uh, I think they are usable, uh, especially for radio amateurs. Here we have, uh, I think, Morse signals on shortwave. And you can hear that this radio doesn't have uh, an automatic gain control on the EF amplifier, so fading plays a role. The signals are stronger and less stronger. <coughs> Sorry. And here you can see how the antenna coil has an effect on the reception. The reception is, by the way, only on this one meter wire. It keeps the uh, tank circuit, antenna circuit, very sharp. So here you see how critical the antenna, the tuning from the antenna coil is. And I think this, these are uh, single sideband uh, radio signals, so I need a BFO, but I, there's no BFO in this radio, so I only can hear them in this way. Uh, let's try to receive some uh, normal radio uh, stations, tune the, the VFO. This is Radio China, I think. On this one meter wire. Tune in the antenna coil. And here you can also see that the tuning of the antenna coil has a certain effect. But because Radio China is a very strong radio station on shortwave, uh, the effect is not very clearly visible. Tune in to a new radio station. So very precise tuning. Tune the antenna coil again. And perhaps it's also interesting to show what happens when we change the uh, the setting from the mixer. I do that here. Now I change the potentiometer. Here there's no mixing result. Here the mixing result comes up. And here it's also no good result. So this is approximately the best position. I also tune now the high frequency amplification. Also good to show. Now we set the high frequency amplification to the minimal and to the maximal position. I also set here the working point, the working point from the second IF transistor.
So this is the best position. Uh, what I show could also be a plea to use fixed value uh, uh, base resistors. Um, but I found after all that this is the best way to do it. We now gonna change the um, amplification from the audio amplifier, one transistor audio amplifier, by tuning the 1k capacitor in the emitter lead. Uh, because this is a very strong radio station, you don't hear the effects, but on a weak radio station you will, you will surely hear the effects. And now we change the working point from the VFO, the heart from our radio. When I touch it, it doesn't work. But okay, let's try. I do it with my hand now, because my hand is, uh, is uh, isolated. So I've tuned the VFO now to another position. The working point from the VFO. And you can also hear and, and see that that has effect. Tune the, uh, turn the working point from the VFO back again with my hand. And tune the antenna cap again. So the receiving results are not very dramatical, but it's possible to receive radio stations on. Uh, the short way with this very simple radio concept. Tune again somewhat.